garden of terror. Hmm, another garden of terror. I can try my sergeant hammer build again. <clears throat> Could you explain, please, to some delusional people that Chromie, Liming, and Sitches do not counter hammer? Yeah, uh, th actually. Well, actually, like, Chromie and Li Ming have positive matchup against any ranged auto attacker, including Sergeant Hammer. It also counts for Zuljin and Raynor. But they don't counter Sergeant Hammer because you don't siege up in teamfights. Will you be at Gamescom? Uh, no plans to do so yet, Christoph. So unlikely, considering it's already going on. And Stitches counters Raynor and Zuljin harder than he counters Hammer, because at least Hammer has W and, and Z. It depends on the speed of follow-up of uh, Stitches' team. I stand ready. Hmm. Have not five level sub. Oh my god, it's actually true. I serve. <laughs> wow. Tremble before me. my path go for some cars in let's fly yeah vikings are very op on this map can you talk about the thought process when you're drafting yeah sure uh so best support against dia zeratul is probably uther but i play uther all the time the next best is Rhaegar, but I'm not super good at him. And actually I felt more like playing Karazim. If Rhaegar gets caught by Zara or Diablo, he can just be dead like that. Brightwing is nice against Zara, but lacks the healing and the crowd control, really, to deal with a lot of things that uh, they can do for prison and uh, apocalypse follow-up. No Game No Life has... The reason we want second support is because Karazim is like fairly aggressive as well. Uh, not Toronto maybe? Karazim can be fairly aggressive. And offers healing but not... He's not 100% enough healing to deal with much of what uh, people can do. Spread. Toronto would be good. I've I climbed know. really. Wood four to wood three since subscribing. Less than three. From wood. Wow, that's really nice. I'm not a crook. Two non-existent league tiers. I, I mean, since it doesn't exist, it has immeasurable value. Thank you for the resub and congrats. Just co-op. Thank you as well for the sub. Do I go seven sided? Hey, look, I got Wolverine. Hatred is unending. Okay, so. Uh, Alright. I think Garrosh is a pretty decent pick here. I like it against their team. Is this a Bloodlust game? Mm, I don't know. I don't think so. 
I don't think you can do that because... Well, it does help to dodge Apocalypse, I guess. But I think it's better just go Ancestral and let me do the damage out. What? <sighs> Bloodlust is actually... It's not crazy here. I'm, I'm kind of starting to think about it, bro, Seth Loudy. I mean, it's not my choice, it's his, but... Easier to dodge Apoc, except, of course, if it's Void Prison into Apoc. Nicer flanking. Everyone gains some healing. We're, we have a lot of auto-attacking. Hmm. Anyway, it's up to him. Greetings, friend. <laughs> Face me, and you will fall. Mm. Fusro, thanks for the sub, man. The battle commences. I'm gonna go for Iron Ten Fist seconds. to punish uh, Zeratur Illidan in the right situation. Five. Uh, Earth allies should be really good against Zeratul and Illidan. The block charges. Must make sure that it doesn't die too easily to Kel'Thas' spells. I welcome a new trial. Is that all? Lend your strength to mine. And uh, for my alt, yes. I think I will go for 7-sided. It uh, ignores the armor. You shall be defeated. It ignores armor. Bring me a and so Diablo's uh, soul shield will not do as much. Have been healed. Heroes, night will fall in just a few moments. I hope you're ready. Correct, I haven't updated Nova yet, video. For the glory of Evgorod. The shamblers rise! Slay them! Claim their seeds! The storm breaks! Go! Bring me a challenge. I need to pull back. The storm! I'm gonna go get the other seeds. Her ally is nice against Zera, but I think Earth ally is better because they also have Illidan. And it's easier to get value out of. Uh, I think it's better just to attack this. It's not so easy to attack into Diablo, Keltas. Does it still not give vision? Oh, that works again. Nice. Where is my boy? Yeah, or we can get some seeds. Can do that. You better head to a healing fountain and hurry. Hmm. Yeah. Well, we didn't get a plan, but that's fine. We're close to getting one next. Wonderful for you. Of course, not as close. Then.
Yeah, I can explain my talent build. Iron Fist for more pressure on uh, highly mobile character like Zeratul. Um, I went for Earth Ally to block the auto attack damage from Zeratul and Illidan. And at 7, I will get Blinding Speed. Uh, for more mobility and more uh, Flurry of Fists, which is what I'll pick at 16, way of 100 Fists. I could actually go Cleansing Touch as well, which would give me a cleanse on multiple allies, which would be very helpful against the likes of Diablo's Apocalypse. But it's not easy to use. Um, to to like do like multiple cleanses during during APOC. For the glory of Evgarod. The glory of Evgarod. Break beneath the endless time. Go! I stay down! Choose a talent. A little bit of strafe disengage. Bring me a challenge. The night comes. There was no reason for him to stay. The battle draws near. I mean, it's literally two v five. There's nothing. Uh... That's my kind of move. Joyous night to have. Oh, he went ancestral. I think that's correct. Yes, that is enough. So the garden terror will be yours. The terror awaits. Come, take its power. Kill. You have failed. I go. I'm glad I came over here. I should have casted more spells before I set inside it, though. I must retreat. I guess I'll take it. Hey, you picked up a seat when he flew over it. Oh, you could use that. You could fly over an enemy terror from here to here and then Rise take their seeds. That's amazing. From your enemies. That's a giant freaking minion wife. Oh, I look at it and I drool. Oh. Your enemy spawns a terror. I was like, oh, he, he wanted to gust him into the wall. I get it. I was about to report him. So, actually, the fact that Plant went top is a blessing in disguise. Uh, because he also preserved enemy minion wife. Because he W'd. Terror, my child, 
collapsed. <laughs> Can you queue on the flying fast and fly with him? No, Q is too fast. Q is actually too fast. I don't know why my Qs didn't proc. I think it's because although I saw Illidan, I don't technically have field of vision. So. <laughs> still took pretty long i guess it's because of six cents i took this one because they have uh diablo stun the hunt stun and keltha stun which gives me physical armor which is very relevant because they have a lot of relevant damage from auto attacks spell shield would be pretty nice too uh, quicksilver pretty decent but then i'm planning to go for the q damage anyway so i'm not gonna dash into ally much Good. Unimpressive. So because it's basic attacks, this one still doesn't go through Illidan's evasion, right? Yes. Mr. Spork, nice message. Thanks, man. <laughs> Coming up. Uh, yeah, Clenting Touch would be pretty decent here as well, but I'm gonna go for the aggression. Since we're, anyway, we have double support. Message to the streamer. The battle draws near. Do some wave clear. Well done. Maybe top. Again. Nice, maximum value heals. Now we get two camps before the seeds. Uh, Zeratul actually would love to go for a solo foul start, so I'm just you gonna go join him in holy matrimony. My mind is clear. Wow, they got Illidan. Yay! The terror awaits. Come, take its power. Wow, they got Rhaegar. Why didn't he self ancestral? Oh my god, that was risky. Ah, the result of this fight shows it was me all along. Huh? Did I just not hit something invisible? Your 
effort be wasted. I must retreat. If they don't Your interrupt me. If they interrupt me, we lost it. He's like, cool story, bro. When they're actually there, it's quite hard to get keep damage like that. The enemy's terror has fallen. Did you see that Q? Your best was easily defeated. My mind is clear. Capably done, team. Uh, my wife helped a lot with the dog care, uh, Grinch Paws, when uh, when he was a puppy. We shared the load uh, equally. Now that he's an adult, it's much easier. But yeah, puppy, <clears throat> puppy can give some sleepless nights. I was the one that wakes up at the middle of the night though to like give him his midnight wee. But he got over that pretty fast. It depends on the dog and how much water you give him at night. The infested return again. Be we can probably force another key. Ah, uh, they're very, very close to level up though. They're 20 already. We could have tried, but it's risky. It's Hero League. Show Garrus's hero damage. 35. Not bad. The battle draws near. Fine work. Stay closer to Garrosh. We see all five of them right now. They went bot, I think. Or top, and I missed it. Zeratos right there. Break beneath the endless time. I will be new trial. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> he, he had a different idea. Not here. That was so nice. Bottom keep. We can also end, but bottom keep is easier, safer. Uh, you okay, bro? Lockdown! Heroes, how I love to see my garden in the moon's glow. Yay! Good draft, good game. All shall kneel before us. So I'll show everyone's talent and stats. Talent build and stats. MVP. What kind of switches in your keyboard? Brown switches. Uh, so he went for the shield with the CDR. Greetings, friend. And then some top stamina. Deadly calm is so good. Hi, Wangledorf. Thanks, man. Uh, multi shot build. I would say hungering is better against Illidan and Zeratul. Hungering. Gloom is a good choice for the hunt. It is Garden, though, so I get multi shot, but I think hungering is safer. You get more soloing potential. But it's a bit higher burden of execution. If you miss it, it's bad. I went for damage, auto attack block, Greetings, more cues, damage cues, anti apocalypse hunt. I use your roll, can't reach it, don't need it. Uh, transgression. Thanks for the sub, man. Transgression for more hits, more damage, kill Diablo. Yeah, Rhaegar, classic, classic uh, support build, actually. I don't see anything funky in their builds. Except Power Blast. I think Phoenix would have done more. I never actually saw Power Blast hit anyone. Yeah, and the fact that they have Lily as solo support is quite, quite hard to deal with. Since we had quite a lot of spell damage. Karzim dash is bugged. It puts you randomly around enemies, even on opposite side. Yeah, I, I I read about that. I heard about that. But I haven't experienced it to be too disruptive. Does he even understand Holy Shock Uther build? <laughs> Agreed. <laughs> 